What's up, Bearcat Nation? Uh, the Crosstown Shootout. Man, I never, I never miss one of those. I never, I never miss one of those. You know, Skyline Chili, uh, the the biggest college basketball, one of the biggest college basketball rivalries of like since like the twenties. And like we are finally here, it's the fi it's finally the week of the crosstown shootout between UC and Xavier. Now UC is host hosting this this year's crosstown shootout. Uh, wait, Xavier's Xavier is not Xavier is not hosting. UC yeah UC is hosting this year's crosstown shootout. So like it's. It's all exciting. It's like it's literally the best. It's literally the best thing of like the environment, the environment of Clifton, the uh, the fans, the, the the players, the coaches. Like all of it comes down to one to one team having like bragging rights for the entire city. Ah, uh, I I've. I've never missed a single game with a crosstown shootout. Never. Uh, as you could tell, um, I am a huge Bearcats fan. As you could tell, all of this uh, uh, merch, merchandise, uh, I've uh, collected over the years. Uh, yeah, got me a jersey, a sweatshirt, a couple of hats. Of course, I'm wearing one right now. And two polos. I think I got a flag around here somewhere. So, yeah, it it's literally gonna be the greatest battle. Uh, but it only can but it only could come down to one winner. Both teams are six and three. Both teams are six and three, and it can only come down to one winner. So, if you're a Bearcats fan, I would I would want I would want to be. I would want to make sure I'm there at the 90th annual Crosstown Shootout because it's it's gonna be, it's gonna be epic. It's gonna just have like there, there's there's obviously nothing else I could say about about this rivalry. There's really nothing I could say about this rivalry, but how of how awesome it is, of how awesome it is, it's just like. It's like it's like wait it's like waiting for this crosstown shootout is kind of like waiting for like Christmas morning. You, you ever like uh you ever like woke up on Christmas morning and then you got they you woke up on Christmas morning and like uh you you got the gift that you wanted on Christmas day. Well, well this well this is it. This is it. This is this is this is kind of like that gift. You see Xavier, three o'clock on ESPN. Man, honestly, ah, uh, it's not now. Nothing else I gotta say, but hey, um, all I know is I'm a Bearcats fan, and like, I'm not rooting for Xavier. I'm not rooting for them. Sorry if anybody anybody out there is a Xavier fan. Just stop just stop rooting for you guys. Don't you get it? This is a rivalry. This is a huge rivalry. Two schools that don't like each other that have had the same beef ever since the night nineteen twenty seven. Since nineteen since nineteen twenty seven, these two have had it at have had it. Uh, the 2011, 2011, there was a, uh, 2011, like, you know, the brawl, I'm pretty sure everybody remember that. Of course, you see, um, there were, uh, certain things, uh, certain illegal things back then, but, uh, yeah, but you see leads the series, you see leads the series, the all time, the all time series. By uh fifty one thirty eight, and that that's that's huge. But all all I can all I can say is right now is I like.
Hey, may the best person, may the best person win. Of course, we already know who it's gonna be. And you know, just have fun. This is a huge rivalry. Without without that being said, I think that the Cincinnati Bearcats will pull this off this year at Fifth Third Arena, three o'clock ESPN. I'm ready. I'm ready, bro. I'm ready for this battle. I'm ready. I'm ready for. I'm ready for Xavier to just stop thinking. Stop thinking that they have the advantage. What? Because once they get in there, because when they step in the Fifth Third Arena, you know everybody's just gonna be hating, hating on them, capping on them, uh, yelling out, yelling out their names and stuff. It's not gonna be a pretty sight for you, Xavier. It's not gonna be a pretty sight for you. So be prepared, Xavier, because you're going to have it coming. It's coming. It's going to happen. As you can tell. I I won't I won't be at the Crosstown shootout. I'll, I'll be, uh, Frank, uh, sadly, I won't be at the Crosstown shootout. But I will be watching. I'll be watching on my phone. If, if uh, my phone, uh, I'll find a way to watch it. And when I, and when I get back. When I get back in Cincy, um, we're just going to celebrate. We're going to celebrate. <laughs> because this is this is for bragging rights. This is for who leads the city of Cincinnati. And most importantly, you forget the most important thing. If you're going to have a Crosstown shootout, you got to have Skyline. you got to have the good old Skyline. So I don't know if you're a three-way person, a cheese cone, cheese coney, uh, chip. You like chili, cheese, onions, like, like just you gotta have Scott. You gotta have Skyline if you're going to this. Uh, if you're gonna watch this uh battle, if you're wa if you're watching it from like uh from a phone, if you're watching it on a phone, if you're watching it on a tablet, computer, or even if you're at the game, if you're at the game or you're at a bar, you you better have Skyline. You better have Skyline. You better have you better have skyline chili on a on a plate. You better have it on a plate, a napkin. I don't care what you have it on. You can have it. You can have it on a. Uh, you can have it in a bowl for all I care. You better have skyline. You better have skyline on like anything you can eat off of. You better have it. Without that being said, I guess i'll wrap up this video thank you so much for watching be sure to like comment subscribe hit that bell notification so you get notified each time i post and uh comment down below what you think the final score will be for this huge rivalry well i'll see you in the next video and as always go bearcats